Hello golfers, I'm teaching professional Brett Bennett. Today we're going to talk about the bump and run. The bump and run requires a club with a little bit less loft. I see many amateurs go straight to their bag once we've got a chip shot such as this. They'll go straight for a 56 or a 60 degree. As we can see, there's a lot of room between us and the hole. What the bump and run is going to allow us to do is to get the ball at a little bit lower trajectory, get the ball on the green and get the ball rolling. When we, sometimes when we grab a 56 or 60 degree, we have the tendency to possibly chunk the shot or thin the ball over the green. The bump and run will eliminate these faults. So once we get to our shot, we notice that we've got quite a bit of distance here. The bump and run is going to allow us to get the ball on and get it rolling. So how are we going to do this? We're going to put the ball in the back of our stance. Feet are going to be close together. Along with that, our stroke is going to be high to low. It's going to be a relatively shorter shot than a pitch shot or other chip shots. From there, go ahead and take your position. Hands a bit forward and go ahead and hit it. Again, the bump and run will allow us to get the ball on the green and get it going towards the hole. It will eliminate those chunk shots or potentially those thin shots that we will hit with our 56 or 60 degree wedges.